My name is Laverne Trahan, um, 312 South uh, 31st Street. <clears throat> I'm just against you raising the rates. You've raised the rates about 50% over the last 13 years. Um, I wish you could uh, eliminate your capital costs. So you have excess power you want to sell, cheaper than normal. So you have dirty power that you want to sell because you have excess of it. I don't understand why you don't shut those systems down so you don't have excess dirty power to sell. And by doing that, you would, of course, <laughs> decrease your overall expense and your overall capital expenses that you currently have maintaining those buildings and those jobs and buying that coal and all that kind of stuff. So it just always disappoints me that you're raising rates to manage the status quo, which you've done every year except for last year over the last 13 years, and um, it versus reinventing yourself as a clean utility which is what I strive every day to uh, bring to you that information. Thank you, bye. Thank you. Sorry. John Pollock, 1412 North 35th Street, Omaha. Um, I am uh, wanting to address specifically the, uh, s the structure of the, uh, the rates. Uh, it continues to bother me that uh, there is a discount per unit of uh, the more the more electricity you use the cheaper it gets and uh, I think there's a natural human tendency that if you say there's a lower price for doing something it operates as an incentive so to me you are providing an incentive uh, to residential customers to use lots of electricity which will eventually reflect in your capital costs as uh, people respond to that. Uh, I think that it should be uh, closer to a flat rate that I realize there is also a charge for uh, for operating the lines and so on and so forth and you you have to find some kind of balance but uh, I also know that uh, there's a human tendency to say, hey, something's cheaper. If you use more of it, you use more of it. Thank you. We are